rice is always an item of interest because it looks so much like rice. Uh, people say, oh, your rice, it's, it's real rice. And no, it's not ri real rice. It is a shell native to the Philippine Islands. And uh, as you'd have it, it's called rice shell. And the raisins are Apache tears. One of my favorite items is, is, the, is the donut. This, was an, this is an artifact. This was made by an Indian some 2,000 years ago. And he used this particular piece here as a lead weight, or a weight, not lead. He used it in place of lead to sink his nets. He put it on his nets and sunk the nets and he caught fish. This was a matter of survival. So this is a work piece. The salt and pepper, uh, the pepper is the most unique of the salt and pepper. The pepper is the ash from Mount St. Helen, the volcano. And this was given to us by a young lady who was at that time a geology student at the University of Texas. And she was one of the chosen few to get into that area on a, a, a very early state. Uh, I think it was about three or four months after the actual explosion. So she got to go into the area and she brought back a, some, some of the ash from Mount St. Helen and donated it to us, gave it to us. By the same token, our black, our black sand, this is off the beaches in Hawaii. Now this is actually lava that's ground up and this was a gift to us also. It, not our particular, it's not our bringing back of lava. We all know that if you, uh, if you go to Hawaii and visit Hawaii and uh, you visit the lava beds, it's, uh, it's uh, very unlucky to take the lava off of the island. That's the reason I tell people this is a gift to us. We didn't bring the lava off, but this is black sand from Hawaii.